Hey, good. Hey, hey, hey. Good morning, everybody. How you all doing? Welcome back. Mixed at number 593. I decided to do a little back to the future as we get higher in the mix fit workouts. We've been at this for almost 10 years now, and this is mix fit number one. I have to have a little modification because we don't have a track to run on, but the first workout is one of two. The first workout is going to be 100 jump rope or jumping jacks, followed by a rep scheme of 15, 12, and nine repetitions of push ups, squats, and sit ups. However, when Jody gets here, we're going to make it a a sort of a partner workout on this first workout. The second workout is a weight workout. We have complexes, so join in, go at your own pace. The first workout, you need no equipment, you need nothing but your body and the will to do it. So let's get started. We're gonna start with 100 jump rope. When Jody comes here, she'll join right in with the 100 jumping jacks. And then we're gonna move on to push-ups, uh, squats, push-ups, and sit-ups. Okay, here we go, everybody. 100, who's in? Anybody in yet? Here we go, and go. 10. 20. 30. 40. Halfway. 60. 80, 90, 10 more, 9, 8, I'm going double, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, good job, hopefully you did your jumping jacks, I'll give you a second to catch up, now we're going to do a rep scheme of 15, 12, 9, I'm going to just adjust the camera a little bit so it's pointing down to the ground, hopefully it does not fall, Squats, push-ups, sit-ups. No body, just body weight. Legs a little wider than shoulder distance. Toes pointing out. Deep breath in, squat one, going to 15. Two. Nice and easy, like you're sitting on a chair. Somebody's pulling a chair out from behind you. Seven, eight, nine, and five more, four. Three, two, one. That's good. You're here for push-ups. The squats. Right? So now that Jody's here, we're gonna do partner push-ups. So you're gonna run that mat right there. I'm on this mat, we're gonna face each other. I can point the camera down a little That's bit. Fine, fine. Here we go. We're gonna push up and we're gonna clap hands. We're going for 15. Are you ready? Okay. I'm gonna do standard push-ups. If you're already who's home doing this, do this with your partner. It's great fun. Deep breath in, let's go. One, other hand. Two, three, four, five, ten more. <laughs> you bang heads sometimes. Go ahead, Al. We'll call that ten. Ten, five more. Good. That's what did I miss? Squats. You missed squats. Come on down. You gotta do sit-ups now. So in the partner sit-ups, we're gonna lock ankles. In your outie. You'll be outie. I'll be in. You'll be in. Okay, I'll be outie. So her How about feet. One of each? <laughs> her, her feet are locking up against my calf. We're gonna both come down. Deep breath in, off we go, camera. And then we'll touch and clap hands a little bit. Two. Go to 15. Go your patty cake. <laughs> Three. Four. Five. Oh, sorry. Six. All right. Take it to another level. Seven. All right. One. Eight. Nine. Ten. <laughs> Other hand. Eleven. Twelve. I want to do this all day. Thirteen. Deep breath in. Exhale all the way up. Thirteen. 14. 14. 15. One more. That's 16. Now we kiss. There we go. Set number two. Wait, that was set number one. You missed it. <laughs> You're running a little bit late. We did jumping jacks. I did jump rope. 
and squat. So now we're gonna go 12 squats, 12 push-ups, 12 sit-ups. Jump rope? Jump rope is after we finish. Okay. Ready? 12. 12. Wait, what are you doing? Wait, 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 wait. We're, we're doing this couple style. You know, you can either hold hands or hold wrists. I like holding hands. Everybody likes holding hands? Here we go, Chris. <laughs> Sorry, it gets with three, four. The last one we're gonna pause the bottom and hold. Go back. I am. No, I'm gonna back. I am. This is back for me. Oh, oh, you mean like that? I thought you meant no, my hips back. Hips back. Oh, where are we at? Ten. Eleven. My knees are coming forward. Okay, down here. Now pull. Pull. Back. Pull. Pull. Okay. Good. Come on up. <laughs> kind of things we do around the Edwards household. <laughs> All right, push-ups, 12. Ready. You ready? <laughs> you got this? Who's in? You're gonna do the same push-up. Now you can do standard push-ups just outside the shoulder. You can go wide, you can go narrow, you can go offset, you can do clapping, jumping. Just your body weight, so use your imagination, do what feels good to you. I know what you're saying. None of this feels good to me. <laughs> Try it, fake it anyway, ready? And go. I think we're going to bang heads. <laughs> One. You'll be the first. You can move it wider. Do it if my count's person. Because I always mess up the counts. Don't I? Nope. Twelve? Yep. Hold hands. Pull, 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 pull. Good. Come on down. <laughs> Sit-ups. Round number two. This is mixed with number one. Started this about ten years ago. He'll be outie. He'll be outie this time. Okay, ready? Up. Oh. Exhale. Gotta do something different this time. I don't like the suit stuff. How why can we, we make it different? Why don't we hit feet? Hit feet? Yeah. Alright. Okay. All right, I like that. Just doing a little bit of. I think we got it. It's getting a little sloppy and a little messy, but. Where are we at? All right, let's do five more. Eight. Could be five more. Nine. Two more. Exhale on the top, sit nice and tall. Good. Always good form, good technique. No momentum. No momentum. Awesome. Okay. Round three, nine reps of each. And then when we finish the last nine, then we go back to jumping jacks and or jump rope for 100 reps. So let's do it a little different this time. Okay. Because we only have nine reps. So why don't we do jumping squats, squat yeah. jumps. Can you handle it? Sure. We gotta face each other and hold hands. Oh, holding hands while jumping? Jump, yeah, it can work. Y'all ready? Deep breath in. Up. One. Two. See this one? Three. Four. Five. Six. I think we're moving. Seven. Eight. Nine. Good. If Jet was here, we'd be jumping into the pool. That's true. Push up. Like a dog. <laughs> Just doing push ups. Doing, we're oh. doing a couple push ups. Why? I can just do them on my knees. Yes, you can. I'm going to do. How can I make push ups different? I can, just, I can just sit on you while you do them. <laughs> you can do that. <laughs> Why don't you do push ups on my back while I do push ups? No, let's just get them done. All right. Ready? Here, move forward a little. That's fine. Yeah, I need you on camera. People need, people need to see you. The beauty of Jody Wayne Edwards. Ready? Go. Oh, wait. Stop. Let's start over. Let's do a double tap. We'll do right and left on one push up. Ready? And go. One. Wait. Right. Well, there you go. A little stability. Two. <laughs> Three. Remember? Four. Four. Who's with us? Everybody home out there. Where are we at? Six. Six, beautiful. Last one. 
Jumping jacks or jump rope, a hundred. What do you want, Al? I'll do jump rope. Good. I'm gonna do jumping jacks this time. Get this out of the way. It's getting a little warm out here. Ready? Go. Two. Out. Rest for a second. Second workout. It's a weight workout. It's called the complex. I'm going to take one set of dumbbells, a barbell if you have it, a medicine ball if you have it, laundry detergent, a pot, a pan, a broom, whatever you have. I'm going to follow these following steps. Complex is a series of exercises all done at once. Sequence this time is 10 deadlifts, 10 back rows, 10 curls, 10 overhead presses. That equals one set. Set for a total of 200 reps. I'll demonstrate. This is a deadlift. Lifting from the ground up. You can also do a straight leg deadlift. Knees slightly bent. Push the butt back a little bit, but keep your back flat and reach straight down. From there, I'm gonna do a back row, just elbows in, wrist to the rib cage, 10 of those, standing up straight, 10 curls, followed by 10 shoulder press. We're doing them controlled, correct? What, you gotta speak up. We're doing them controlled, not, not ripping them out. We're not ripping these out, we're not ripping them up. This is all, this will work your entire body, just like the first, workout did without weights. So here's two key points that Jody made mention of one, control. Nice and control, work the entire body as a single unit. Well, the that's, same weight. No, that, that's point number two. Very good. Thank you. So he's thinking ahead of me. Point number two is you can do what's called a drop set. If the weight starts getting a little bit too heavy, if it starts getting a little too challenging, if you're losing a little bit momentum or it just doesn't feel right, put that weight down and pick up something lighter. So I brought up four sets of weights. I will start with a little bit heavier, but we'll move to lighter. Okay, ready? Ellie, ready? All right, we're gonna take a second to set up. I posted this workout online on the Facebook Live site so you can see what you need. All right, you ready? Nice. I have a 15, she has a 20. You want to swap? No, only because I can do the deadlift with this. Okay. All right, so we're starting with 10 deadlifts. Deep breath in, feet. Just, I have my feet underneath my hips. Deep breath in, I'm going to sit back. And Jody's doing a straight leg deadlift. I'm just doing a 
the standard lifting from the ground. Three. Something like that, I think. Four. Sorry. It's always the point. It's always, it's always what happens, right? <laughs> breathe. Make sure you're breathing. Good. So from here, we're going to go to rows. You want my 15? Back rows. This is for your back. I'm going to face this way so you can see the different angle. Jody's in the front. Elbows in. Wrist to the rib cage. Slight bend in the knees. My back and her back is nice and straight. Just squeezing at the top. Down slow. Squeeze at the top. Down slow. Power. Pause. Down slow. Control the movement. Make sure your head and neck is in line. Your ears are over your shoulder. After that, going right into 10 curls. So if you need to adjust your weight, do it now. You ready? Move over a little bit, Joe. Okay. Squeeze at the top, down so. Always control the weight on what's called the eccentric, the lowering phase. When you're fighting against gravity, you just don't want it to plop down. Keep it control. That's where the, that's where the music is. Where you at, Al? Good. Now, just transitioning from here, shoulder press. Elbows wide here, I'm bringing my arm to a 90 degree angle. Exhale at the top, down control. Tummy tight, you notice, nice straight column, tummy tight, glutes are tight, so right everything is locked one? in. That's set number one, we're going right to the next one. If you need to rest, please rest. Use your judgment on this. So this time I'm gonna do straight like that. Though. Really feel it in the glutes and the hamstring. Good strength and exercise for the lower back. Make sure you keep that back nice and straight and try not to round, keeping your shoulders engaged in the socket without them drooping down. Back row again. I'm gonna go heavier this time. Want the 15s? No. It's heavy day. I'll go in the side again. Deep breath in, exhale. If you look and see my ears are over my shoulder, but back squeezing tight. You can do these single arm. You can do one at a time. Curls, I'm gonna stay with the 20s, a little bit heavier on my curls. If you notice on the curls, what I like to do when I'm doing dumbbells, and I think Jody does the same, it's rotating up and then rotate back. So my thumb's facing forward, rotating up. So my palm is facing me, and then back down. So again, everything here, tight, tight. Do this nice tight column. Even though this is a bar, this is a bicep exercise, the front of the arm, your entire body, your core, everything, really gets worked on this. From here, same thing. And if you want a little bit of a more challenge. So you do them on a single leg. Single arm, single leg. There you go. Now you're putting a lot more core activation into the movement. Other leg, good. I'm just walking by. I'm sorry? I'm just walking by. It's in our yard. Oh no, it's in the front yard. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. I thought through, we had somebody I joining us. The house. I thought it was reflecting that too. Sometimes we get people just driving by, walking by, because they want to work out with us. But, uh, <laughs> set number three, three of five. Anybody in this? This time I'm gonna go back to the regular deadlifts. I think this time I'm gonna do, I'm gonna hold them both in one hand and lift from the bottom. So starting from here, coming straight up, a little more sumo squat this time. Legs are out wide here. When you do sumo, you're gonna feel more in here and also in the glutes as well. Hips come back. My back's staying a little bit more vertical than the standard deadlift. Getting down a little bit deeper. Because my legs are wider, so my hips are able to move a little bit more freely. Back to back rows. You want my 20s? <laughs> no. <laughs> Can't pawn off these 20s. Okay, back rows. Thumbs are up. You can also have them where your palms face back, but it starts hitting your upper back a little bit too much. You get into your trapezius, which you really don't want in this exercise. Sorry, I got to. Sweating a bit here. 
How you doing, Al? Awesome. Good. Curl. What do you want? What's your poison? <laughs> Still no way I'm going to throw up. All right. It's super hot out here. It is beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. We're privileged to be able to do this. Here we go. Ten. Go. Uh, this time I'm keeping it straight. Palms facing forward instead of the rotating. Squeezing at the top, down slow. Squeezing at the top, down slow. It's all right. Take your time. It's not about speed here. What we said last week, mix with number 592, strength in numbers. It's about consistency. Consistency over intensity any day. Just do a little bit. Do what you can. And if you want, build up on it. Heavier All right, so I'm going to go on to shoulder press. I'm going to do what's called an Arnold press. Palms are facing me, elbows go in, up, rotate, and up. We'll move back a little bit so we can get on camera. Two, three, so heavier. four, five, six. Okay, set number four coming up. We're taking a break. <laughs> <laughs> you can take a break. I don't know how it is for the people watching, but you can take any jokes. <laughs> Got anything funny to share? I'm the worst joke teller ever. Nah. All right, so I'm gonna put. I'm gonna push on. How should I do the deadlift this time? You be the coach. Me? You coach me. How would you have me do deadlift? Uh, single leg. Good one. I didn't even think of single leg. All right, single leg deadlift. I'll do single leg too. I'm going to grab something light. I'm going to grab the 15s. Take the 12s. So show them on the side view a single I, leg deadlift. I told you to do them, not me. <laughs> no, but you're, you're much better at them. But so one leg is straight, knees other than this is really advanced. Are we just doing side each leg? No, we'll, here we, have, we have two more sets here. We'll do 10 on this and 10 on the other. Okay. So things you need to know about this. I'm going to put this down because this is very serious. If you're in platform shoes, running shoes, I advise you take them off because they're too cushy and the ankle really can move a lot. So you want to get a little bit flatter to the floor. If you can barefoot, great. If you have a flatter shoe like Chuck Taylor's, um, something like that. With this, it's a little bit too unstable. Okay. <laughs> so I couldn't describe it, so we'll get it next time. Back rows. one at a time. Same movement though, nothing has changed. Next week we're going to combine the back row with a push-up. It's called a renegade row. Y'all remind me next week for the renegade row. Curls. Deep breath in, I'm going back to Trying to, to make sure I'm not getting too cardio. She's not, Joe doesn't want cardio today. <laughs> so I'm going to do curls. Next week when we do a complex, we're going to do opposite. We're going to do, we'll do some squatting, some cardio, some triceps, some upright rows, some lateral raises, seven, eight, nine, ten. You see, I was starting to use some momentum and body weight for one or two. You know, it's not so bad, just as long as you keep it um, under control. A little body English isn't bad, because that's what you do in real life. How are you doing now? She's doing what's called hammer curl, He's which struggling. I'll do my last set. There's no rotation at all, thumbs forward, pinky back, coming straight up. If you have kind of tight elbows or sore able to elbows or tendonitis, hammer curls. If you have to do curls, is the way to go. Going back to traditional shoulder press, reaching up high, never overextending my elbow keeping a slight bend at all times, never coming too far below parallel of the ground horizontal because I don't want to jeopardize my shoulder health. Okay, last set. How are we going to make this fun? How are we going to make this different? I have to do the second leg. Okay, so Jody's going to do the second leg. And I just want to take, I want to get some more cues on that, if that's okay. And this is my harder to balance on leg. Okay, everybody has a harder to balance leg and an easier to balance leg. 
So again, with the shoes, be very mindful of your shoes because if you can see her ankle is you know, moving, but that's really good. As long as it's used for good, not evil. Hips should remain stable, meaning one cheek shouldn't be too much higher than the other. The butt cheek should be stable. Leg kicks back and the momentum drives back. Nice looking, beautiful straight back. You really feel it here, right? Here and there. It's a great, great, what we call posterior chain exercise for the leg. Good, back rows. My turn. I'm gonna do them, but I'm taking a little break in between each one. All right. You gotta know yourself, you gotta know your limits. What you can okay. do, what you can't do. Today I'm getting breathy. Getting breathy? Yeah. Okay. Go. Three, four, five. This is exciting stuff, isn't it, everybody? <laughs> it's so exciting. Lifting weights is like, you can just hear the music pounding, the heart beating, the movements. Makes you feel like you're at a club, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, taking some illegal. Please, make reference to just lines. And about to pass out. <laughs> I'll know, I know if you watch the entire video, if you can reference a line, lifting weights is a lot like being in a club. If you can reference this line, then I know you've made it through. In the comments, right? Lifting weights is a lot like being in a club. So I'm gonna do a hammer curls this time, and Jody is too. Palms facing me, pinkies <laughs> back. I gotta put that. Thumbs forward. Straight up. I'm a mere mortal. Squeezing at the top, down slow. Again, stomach tight, glutes tight, legs tight, shoulders back, chest up. Okay. He's getting dizzy. Somebody out there, please call 911. I think Jody's about to pass out. I'll just do them down here. We're gonna turn this Maybe into I'll do a, them lying down. We're gonna turn this into a CPR class. I'll do them lying down. Because she's doing these actually. Are, these are a, coffin curls. I like them. These are called coffin curls, and we don't mean that in a disrespectful, dead manner. Um, usually, you would do them with cables. You can straighten think? your arms to the ground as hard. But I digress. We're getting. I'm up to shoulder press now. I'm a little heavier for shoulder press, but. You back with Neil? Yeah, but let me just. Okay. Whenever I get dizzy when I stand, so let me get there slowly. All right, our okay. last set of shoulder press. Good job. Ready? I'm dizzy. <laughs> All right, I will do them solo. Deep breath in. I'm gonna do Arnold again. Arnold. Ready? Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't want the sport not to end. We can even put a little rotation on if we want. Nine, ten, champion. Champions, I'm gonna just do a couple little kickbacks. I don't I want miss? this workout to end. We're having so much fun beginning. here. I missed 15 squats. Oh yeah, you owe 15 squats. Move on camera, please. And you owe 15 push-ups. 11, I thought I did the push-ups with you. Now you did 12. No, I think you did 15. Yeah. Oh wait, jump you rope. missed 100 jump rope or jumping jack. So Jody's going back to workout number one. We just don't want this workout to end. We've created some sort of bond here. That is, that is we, cre we created a bond? We created a bond that has transcended. So I have 100? You have 100 jump rope or jumping jacks. I recommend jump rope. Yeah. You can end the video. I don't have to do it on video. No, you got to do it on video. That's all part of the workout. All right, buddy. Here we go. Who's gonna join her on 100 jumping jacks or 100 jump ropes? Okay. Dizzy. No, you don't have to do this now. Yeah, I am gonna do it. All right, let's go. Come on, get on camera. I can't start get centered. Dizzy. Come on, boom, 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 knock them out. Let's go. It's Give been a long a, time since I've bossed anybody around. Give me a minute. I can do them good. Sit down. I'll just pass out. Okay. Those Slide over. Those are in the way. Slide over right here. It's too funny. Right there. No. <laughs> Go ahead, just jump. Just jump. That's her jump roping. I already did mine. I don't have to do any more. Beautiful form. Elbows in. The good thing with jump rope, if you're looking for form on jump rope, keep the elbows in. The movement comes from the wrist. A lot of people do them with the elbows. I mean, when you first start off, yes, elbows and shoulders, but eventually you want it to break down to the wrist, and then you can just move a little side to side. Can you move a little side to side up? Yeah. I mean, just hop like one foot, the other foot. Sorry. 
How many? That was 60. Yeah, you got 40 more. Why'd you stop for? Because you were distracting me. <laughs> <laughs> My ponytail was falling Stay out. Stay focused. Don't want people distracted. Let this end already. Don't it can end. Uh -uh, you got 40 more. Nobody's watching this anyway. Nobody's made it this far. If you made it this far, and, well, I guess if you've made it this far, put in the comments, yeah, I saw Jody only do 60 jump ropes, and she's not going to do the rest. Just write that in the comments. Ready? Here we go. 40 more. Go. 10. Halfway. Halfway. Go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty. We're done. Great job, Al. Everybody give it up for Al. Pat in the butt, little kiss. Great job, everybody. I hope you all did the workout. I hope you watched I'm the workout. Dying today. Thank you for tolerating it. She's not really dying today. <laughs> it's just a figure of speech. Love y'all. See you next week. Mix with number five ninety.